It is a cold day here in the UK. I have a 30 minute walk ahead of me. And it didn't help that last night, my radiator just straight up did not work. So I had to sleep in this super cold room and I was freezing the whole night, but that's okay. Today is orientation day for my new school and I'm getting really excited. But before I do that, I got a little bit of my room set up. It looks pretty nice. Hold on, let me turn off the light. I feel like the fairy lights kind of all bring it together. Still have a little more decorating to do, but there will be an official room tour coming soon. just got done eating breakfast and I want you guys to meet my new friends, my flatmate. Hey. How's it going? Good. Yeah. So my name is Foucault, I'm 21, I'm from south of France and I'm here in order to, to study uh, law and uh, international relation. Cool. And uh, what do you hope to like get out of this semester here? Like um, I want to make new friends to discover new culture and uh, yeah, stuff like that. Nice. So yeah, we're going to be leaving for orientation soon and I'm going to be taking you along with. Can't wait for you guys to see. First meeting, we have a 30 minute break, so we're gonna go get some coffee at the little cafe that they have there. But um, I'm really liking the campus right now uh, to the North Central people who are familiar with it. This is kind of like the Wentz Science Center equivalent. Uh, it's a really nice facility, would you guys say so? Yeah, I agree. Yeah. yeah, it's nice. Harry Tottle would always be full anyway, but they are, yeah, once you book with us, it is guaranteed to go. We just finished with our orientation day one and uh, we checked out the library after and we tried to work their little uh, moving electronic bookcases but we were making a bunch of noise and we were supposed to be quiet and I was feeling a little conscious of everyone around because when we were leaving there was this guy sitting at the table and he looked like he wanted to kill us for making noise so uh, either way we're gonna head home now. Today's gonna be a pretty chill day and because um, we've been kind of out and about so we're gonna take some time to just rest at home and I'm going to finally show you guys a room tour with a quick time lapse. We stopped at this fish and chip place Look how big that is. I did not know it was gonna be that big. I thought it was gonna be like fish fingers. Uh, which one did you get? I got mushrooms. Mushroom? <laughs> the uh, mushrooms, those look pretty good. And yeah, I'm ready to dig in. Look how big that is. This is my, my hand for scale. Wow. Album covers. Right, the album covers are up. I feel like I want to print more to fill in that space and that space, but I like how it turned out so far. All right, so this is my official room tour. This is what it looks like when you walk in. Turning on the light right here at the door. You have some very nice pictures of me and CJ. We have a little command hook that was left here by the last person, so that's good. I hang my hats on that. And then I have this bulletin board with a bunch of orientation stuff from today. Coming down on my desk, I have a mouse, a new notebook from today as well. And here's my laptop that I've always used. And right here, I have a bunch of plugs that allow me to use my US charger. So that's a little adapter. And what's super cool is that I learned in the UK that they have these little switches. Like for example, when I'm charging my phone, I have to turn it on and then it switches on, which is interesting because we don't have that back in America. Over here, I have my headphones, this little disposable camera that my sister got me for this trip, AirPods, and also my microphone that I'm gonna be doing for podcasting. Down here, I have hoodies, other things like towels, and my shoes. 
and there's a little rubbish bin, that's what they call it here. And coming at my little window, I have this little, little attic space here, which I think it looks pretty cool. Here's my water bottle, my switch, and then this is Pascal, you might remember him from previous videos. Here's my Flynn Rider satchel that I'm gonna be using. And then this very cute message bottle thing that CJ got me, it has a bunch of notes inside that I could read on this trip. Over here is my bed. I got an entirely new set of sheets because the sheets that they gave us here weren't really good. They were kind of low quality and they felt like shower curtains, so this is much better. I have this really big tapestry which I was able to fit into my luggage, surprisingly, and that's good because it covers a lot of wall space. Here's my nightstand, I have my iPad which is also my alarm clock, my passport, and other miscellaneous stuff down here that you guys don't really need to see. Right here, as you guys know, is my album wall that I'm a big fan of. And here's the luggage that I brought, my plane ticket, dresser with things, and then all of my clothes were able to fit into these three drawers. And that's my laundry basket for now. <laughs> I should probably get something better than that, but this box was here when I came. So until I get a new one, that's what I'm gonna be using. It's an extra backpack, and then different command hooks that hold different things. And yeah, that is my room. I feel like it came out pretty good. Let's see it one more time with the lights off. I'm really glad with how it turned out. I'm definitely not done with decorating it. I feel like throughout the year, I'm gonna be adding more stuff onto there. And you guys might see like things slowly change around this room on the walls. And that would be cool to see what you could spot.